Hello everyone, uh, in this video I want to show you how easy it is to create uh, sprite buttons for your application. Here I will use my previous created uh, plugin for Unity is uh, Atlas Editor. So here I have a collection of uh, different sprites, brush, bucket and eraser. And so I just want to create uh, buttons which will have three states, normal, on hover and on click. So at first let's create a, a, an atlas. Uh, let's drag uh, all these sprites. Align them and uh, save as a new one. It will be saved in a root folder. You can find it here. Let's uh, move it to a specific folder here. And next we need to create the material. <coughs> it will be uh, trans transparent and lit. Okay, next we need to create a camera. And uh, to make it pixel perfect, we need to have a size which will be which will equal to the half of the height of our camera. In my case, uh, I have a seven six eight, uh, so the height will be three. The size of the camera will be three eight four. So alta graphics and three eight four. So we are ready to create uh, buttons. Uh, here you can find a new menu. This is a plugin which I am working on. And here we can choose uh, Atlas. In our case it's just one. Uh, then we can choose a different textures from our Atlas. This is for normal state, for power and on click. Uh, this uh, Parameter just indicate that the size for the textures in the same is the same, and uh, width and height is picked up from the last chosen value of these three uh, textures. Here we can choose the material. Values for material in Atlas is cached, so next time when you will open this screen, uh, it will be automatically be shown here. And uh, button name will be brush button. Uh, create button. Okay, this plugin created for us a new mesh. So we will move mesh to mesh folder. Each button will have a separated mesh. And that's all. When you will click on the scene. Ah, we don't see it <laughs> because we need to move this sprite inside the camera. So I will move the camera just a little bit in the front. Okay, when you will click, you will see that it works. Three state on hover, on click. So let's create uh, one more button. Uh, the same atlas, so the same material. So here we will have a bucket. Let's move the mesh, the mesh folder. Oh, we forgot to rename the object name, so it will be the it will have the same as a texture one. So let's rename it here. Oh. Like this. Move it here. Check it how it works. Boom, boom. Everything is okay. And now we need to handle the click value on hover right value. If you will open the UFT button class, 
Okay. You will find that it has uh, two static delegates on button click and on button hover. And it passes the value itself. So let's create a new script, which will be uh, button manager. When it starts, we need to register. Uh, we need to register uh, our events. It passes the button object, so here we will just show in the console which uh, button is it clicking on. Okay, and uh, attach this class to the camera. Let's start our scene and check how it works. Booms, booms, it's on hover, and when we click uh, brush, we will see the button brush has been clicked. That's it. All of this plugin is uh, free, so you can download it currently, I think, just from uh, my site, which you can find in the description of this video. And Atlas Editor is available in a set store. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.